Uh, we got lot one, uh, this 12 3 Duroc Barra. This is a be a stay in your lane there at Purple Power, a boar that uh, doesn't know need introduction, a uh, hog that uh, kind of dominated the Reds last year in terms of being at uh, the Guild out the Expo and then won the Indiana State Fair uh, uh, Barra there. So, and then the mom would be a Red Mamba. Uh, that particular sow uh, came from uh, Trace Amigos. Uh, that was a sow that the, the John McCall family in Texas would show to, uh, and uh, bo a guy that we deal with with a lot of our show pigs down there and has done an extremely good job for us. He went ahead and sent her back to me and let me uh, kind of farrow out and get her bred here. And uh, I'm glad, sure glad he did because uh, what she's done here in three litters has been really good for us. And um, this litter, I mean, probably definitely her her best litter in terms of quality and uh, and ones that can go to uh, any level and compete. Uh, uh, there's going to be four of these uh, Duroc Barras, and I think all four are just – top of the notch type of red hogs uh, uh if you can see here at this dash three i mean just the look and design and uh, and uh it's just awesome uh, and in terms of flexibility gets out and moves uh, this one uh longer you feed them i think it's gonna be i mean just I mean, make you happy every day. You go out in the barn to look at because I think this one's gonna be very, very competitive and and just with that kind of look and design and uh, and knowing what this one could do with his pedigree, uh, I think this one will be very fun all summer long because I mean, just uh, you get a look over top of his uh, his top line there. I mean, just as straight as all his angles, but uh, and having a good uh, square hip on him and tracks away extremely good. Uh, this would be lot one twelve dash three.